Good morning, you guys. Welcome back to my channel. I just woke up like an hour ago and now it's currently 8.02. I just got my cup of water for the morning. Y'all know it's good to drink a cup of water first thing in the morning because it flushes out all that toxin we store in our body overnight. So here I am. Usually in the morning, I just grab a bottle of water straight out of the fridge and just drink it like that. But today, I kind of want to have lemon in there. So I just put it in the cup. I like my little skull cup. I got this like last year during Halloween, I think. Y'all, I freaking love water with lemon. Every single time when I go out to eat, I always ask for a cup of water with lemon. If they don't give me lemon, I don't want to drink it. It just gives so much more flavor to the water and it's like so freaking refreshing. So, so for today's video, I'm going to be showing you guys what I eat in a day and also taking you guys with me to what I'm going to be doing today. I have my gym fit on. Obviously, I'm gonna go work out first and then after that, I'm gonna make my breakfast. Little life update, I am currently 30 weeks pregnant. It's so freaking crazy. I can't believe how fast the time has been going. I swear, I just found out that I was pregnant not even that long ago and it's been like almost eight months. It's so freaking insane to me. Just to think about in 10 more weeks, I'm going to meet my baby boy. Ooh, crazy. I'm going to be a mom. And I still can't digest that in my head right now. I think after the baby shower, that's whenever everything is going to be more real, I guess. My baby shower is in about three weeks. One of the things we're going to do today is go shopping for my baby shower dress. I don't know why I can't find. I'm just going to go to the mall and some places just to see if I can find something cute and it fits my big old belly. But yeah, not going to lie, I am a bit nervous thinking about birth and all that stuff. But I'm also super excited to know that I'm about to meet my baby. My excitement is definitely taking over the nervousness. And also, i just been trying to tell myself and make myself think more positively because I know that either way, this baby is going to come out one way or another. So might as well just think more positively and just relax because... That baby's gonna come and stress doesn't do anything and that's the last thing I wanted to think about in my head. All that matter is if my baby comes out healthy and that's all I care about honestly. So this is what I eat right before I go to the gym. It's just a little protein bar. I don't like going to the gym whenever I have a big meal because it's just, it makes me feel too full to work out. So something like this or I'll eat a banana right before. And then after that's whenever I will make my breakfast and actually eat a meal. So yeah. Just got to the gym. So today I'm going to be doing some upper body and some cardio. First thing first, headphones. just got back from the gym so I was there for about an hour today's upper body back day and cardio so I got that done I'm so ready to eat I'm going to show you guys what I'll be making for my breakfast it's really easy all I'm making is breakfast tacos basically it's called chorizo tacos wait chorizo potato tacos that's what they're called and I'm gonna show you all this stuff that I'm gonna use to make it it's super freaking easy not that many things you need 
So this is all pretty much all the stuff that I need. Obviously, you need your chorizo. I just got the pork chorizo because this is my favorite chorizo. Sometimes I get the veggie ones. It just depends. Eggs and then a potato. I won't be using the whole potato, just half of it. And then onion. Lastly, your tortillas. Going to be using three eggs. I'm going to be using some salt and pepper. Now I'm going to add my onions in it. Now I'm going to get another pan to heat up the tortillas. I know it doesn't look that much aesthetic pleasing, but it does look really freaking good. So this is my breakfast. So I just took a quick shower and got dressed because I'm about to head to the mall and trying to find me my baby shower outfit because I still don't have my outfit yet. And my baby shower is in three weeks. Yikes. Every single time when I'm thinking about I'm about to have my baby shower and then after that I'm about to have my baby, it gives me goosebumps crazy it is almost 11 o'clock so i'm gonna go i guess i'll see you guys at the mall i have to feed the kid i just got one egg roll since i just ate breakfast and she hasn't eaten anything yet so that me looks so weird in the camera it looks so red it's really red the noodles are overcooked really yeah huh Let's try this egg roll. This egg roll is like one dollar and forty cents. It's tiny. Mm. It's like smaller than Panda Express egg roll. They overcharge you. Mm, it's okay. Yeah, I definitely overcharge it. It's the mall. That bowl used to be like five dollars. Now it's like eight. We just got back to Darian's mom's house because Mimi has to get some stuff. I did not find the dress that I need. Everything was so either too small or it's just not really my style. So we were literally walking around for like two hours. My back is hurting so bad. My hips and my feet. So it was just like not a success. I knew it was going to be hard to find me a dress. And I guess I'll just have to go another day. Probably not to the mall, somewhere else that has a, like a lot of dresses to find me one. Because I don't want to order online. If I order online and it doesn't fit, I'm going to be so pissed. So that's that. That's the little update. The only thing that I got from the mall was two bras. So I guess I got something at least. So yeah, I'm about to go home and 
probably chill for a little bit. I'm really tired. So, yeah. So, we just got home and I'm about to make me a smoothie. These are all the ingredients, all the stuff that I need to make my smoothie. First thing first, you need banana. Okay. And then I usually use this kind of fruit for my smoothie. It's a smoothie fruit anyway. So this one has mango, pineapple, banana, and coconut. Then I get a scoop of peanut butter. Almost gone. A scoop of peanut butter. And a little bit of honey. And then lastly, I have my oat milk. Alright, so now I'm just gonna drink this. This is my kind of like a snack, afternoon snack. And then I'm gonna go read for a little while and then probably take a nap, watch TV, just chill because I've had a long day. So, yeah. <sighs> I'm so freaking tired, honestly. Look at my beautiful belly. <laughs> Anyway, so I'm about to read and drink my smoothie at the same time. Alright guys, so I just woke up from my nap. I did end up taking a nap because I was so freaking tired. I guess today really wore me out just from walking around at the mall and plus working out and waking up really early today. But yeah, um, I just woke up. I think I woke up from my nap because I was hungry and it is obviously dinner time. It is 7 o'clock. So I'm going to be showing you guys what I will be making for dinner. So yeah, let's head to the kitchen. So for dinner, I'm going to be making my salmon rice ball. It's super freaking easy to make. Honestly, all you really need is just a couple things. Obviously, you need your salmon and then your rice. I just got this boil in bag rice because it's like super easy to make. Mayonnaise, sriracha, cucumber, avocado, lastly, some green onions. And that's it. And it's super freaking easy to make. Like I said earlier, I'm such a lazy cook. So whatever is easiest and you can make it delicious, I'm all for it. So yeah, so let's get started. I love cucumbers. Then salmon into my air fryer. Salmon is done, looking so delicious. This is the final salmon bowls. I made two bowls so then I can eat one tomorrow. So yeah guys, so this is my famous salmon bowl. It's super easy to make. As you guys can see, I didn't even make that many dishes, which is like amazing because I hate doing dishes after I finish cooking. That's the, literally the last thing I want to do. I'm so freaking happy 
I made my dinner. So yeah guys, this is all for today's video. I hope you guys really enjoyed watching. If you did, please don't forget to give me that big thumbs up. And also, if you guys find any of those dishes that I made today delicious or anything, if you guys want to try it, and if you did try it, please comment down below and let me know what you guys think about it. All these are really easy to make, so y'all shouldn't have any problem making it. So yeah, um, I'm about to enjoy my dinner, so... I guess I'll see you guys all in my next video. Bye.